Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Destiny Mata. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations passion and perseverance thank you you may now be seated today is wednesday may 10th 2023 now let's take a nice and relaxing brain break you breathe in through your nose and then you hold that breath when he goes down you breathe out gently through your mouth and hold again. Great, this time let's do it together. Breathe in and hold and then breathe out and hold again. That was so calming. Now let's see what happened today in history with Mia. Thank you, Destiny. Patriots. In today's history on May 10th, 1872, Victoria Woodhall is the first woman nominated for president of the United States. Victoria Woodhall was a leader of the women's suffrage movement, which is the fight for women's right to vote. This persuaded her to participate in the presidential race. She was also a first woman to start a weekly newspaper, which encouraged many women and girls to do so today. This was a very brave thing to do because back in the 1800s, Many women did not have the fair rights that men did. Victoria Woodhall was a great showblazer. Now let's see what's today's lunch with Hadassah. Thank you, Nia. Today's tasty lunch is corn dogs, turkey ham sandwich, celery, sweet potato waffle fries, and your choice of milk. And tomorrow's breakfast is bagel, cream cheese, graham crackers, fresh banana, 100% grape juice, Lucky Charms, cinnamon toast crunch, and your choice of milk. Students, keep in mind lunch and breakfast can change at any time and to always bring your lunch card. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you'll be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to destiny. Thank you, Hadassah. Students, this quarter's instructional software challenge ends on June 2nd. There is still a lot of time to complete this challenge, so check the flyer for the requirements and keep passing those lessons. The state testing season is continuing today, with 5th grade taking their second session of their science FCAT. Let's all wish them good luck. Please don't forget our cell phone policies. It is important to make sure you have your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And also, don't forget you are not allowed to chew gum in school. Make sure to spit it out before you enter the building. On May 23rd at 6 p.m., our Performing Arts Department will be presenting the Spring Music Concert. It is $5 cash at the door per person to get in, and all funds will go to the Music Department, so make sure to show some support. The Lip Sync Battle is also coming up and will be hosted by the Pines Cheerleaders next week Thursday at 6.30 p.m. If any of you students want to sign up, make sure to stop by Miss Stone's room and buy your pre-sale tickets on myschoolbucks.com. Can't wait. Pre-sales for the yearbook are now on sale on myschoolbooks.com for $35 and are available now. Prices will go up to $45 after May 12, so try and order yours while it's still on sale. Remember the Patriot store is open every morning. Tomorrow morning is the 7th and 8th graders' turn to go. Don't forget your tickets. And another reminder is that this week is Teacher Appreciation Week, so try to get your teacher a small card or gift if you can. Now let's see what the weather looks like today with Tatiana. Thank you, Destiny. Today's weather is expected to be a nice 90 degrees Fahrenheit with partly cloudy skies. In other weather news, what you're about to see is truly a sight to behold. What you're seeing is known as a full moon rising. This full moon rising, in particular, was filmed in Byron Bay, New South Wales. Full moons occur every 29 days to a month. Full moons rise at sunset and set at sunrise. Did you know that in May, Full moons are called flower moons. They're called this because of its yellow, spring-like appearance in May. Now let's go to Ariel for our birthdays. Thank you, Tatiana. There are no birthday boys and girls today, but I hope you have a wonderful day. Now let's go back to Destiny. Thank you, Ariel. 
Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Arnold, Miss Newen, Miss Cavalita, and Miss Dunn. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's daily challenge, which was, what can you hear but not see or touch, even though you can control it? The correct answer was your voice. Now for today's daily challenge. Daily challenge. What is the missing number? Teachers, please send your answers to puns.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone on RPTV would like to wish you all a wonderful Wednesday. And remember, here at Pines, we are going to renew excellence in education. Have a great day.